Hello, I am now going to show you guys how to use another favorite product of mine that I really don't think I could live without at this point. Um, it's the Rene Fortier, I think that's how you pronounce it, um, dry shampoo. It's amazing. Uh, this is the small version. There's one slightly larger. Uh, this one's $15. I believe the other one's like 25 I think. Um, so it's not totally cheap, but it's definitely worthwhile. Um, and for me, as you can tell right now, I've got sort of like a limp, greasy hair situation going on. It's a couple uh, days slept in and all of that. Um, you don't necessarily have to let it go that long before you use this, but um, it's great to use like after the gym or... Um, I know, lots of different reasons. If you just at the end of the work day, your hair is feeling a little limp, you need to go out that night, this thing is great. So um, the way to use it is to lift the hair off the uh, scalp like this, and you're going to shake this up and hold it a few inches away from the hair, and in little spurts, kind of just spray it up at the roots. And then I'm just going to kind of make a section here, pull it over. And just kind of keep separating, you know, you don't have to make it too specific, but, you know, a couple inches around. Spray it at the roots. And then you can kind of just spray around the scalp where it would get greasy, like down by the ears. And then do the same on this side. Okay, and then you don't want to forget the back of your scalp. You don't want that to be all greasy, so just kind of part everything forward so you get in there. All right, and then you're supposed to let it sit for a little bit. Um, approximately two minutes you can let it sit, but sometimes you don't always have that much time. So let it sit for as long as uh, you have, and then just start to like work it into your hair. Make yourself look crazy. And flip. If you want, you can use a towel to absorb any extra product if it's in there. You can change up your part or you can keep it down the middle again. We'll do the middle so that it's the same as before. And you can brush it out so that the product gets distributed down your hair. As you can see, it just sort of absorbed all that oil. It doesn't look all uh, kind of damp and greasy like it did before. Um, I still could use maybe a little extra styling on the hair, which you can do after you put in the product. Um, but at least it eliminated that like stuck to the head uh, grease ball look. <laughs> so I feel much more confident being able to go outside after you use that and absorb all the grease in your hair. So again, I've tried a lot of different jam dry shampoos. Some of them look too chalky. Some sometimes even make it look more greasy, I think. Um, some I don't like the smell. They're too potent. This one just seems to be like the great one right in the middle of everything. It absorbs the right amount. doesn't look chalky. Um, and the smell is really like neutral, very fresh, nothing too flowery or um, you know too perfumey. So um, doesn't really compete with whatever your normal shampoo fragrance or perfume would be. So, um, again, Rene Fortier, dry shampoo, the bomb.